The Generate handheld x-ray device is a very unique, slim, compact device which will allow you to easily take and position uh, the handheld x-ray device um, by triggering the front x-ray button on the front of the uh, tube. This is a complete package with a dental sensor and a Surface Pro. Today I'd like to discuss the new handheld uh, portable x-ray. You have the power button up here on the back. When you press that on, it comes on, you see the blue light flashing. You have the different size of patient. So basically the patient size, where it's a, it's a small, medium, or large patient. And then you can f actually select the, the, the position of the, of the teeth that you want to x-ray. Notice here on the, on the uh, right-hand side, this is the number of seconds. And so when you're actually shooting the x-ray, you can actually see how many seconds or milliseconds it's going to be taking. In the front, you have the cone. You have the scatter radiation. You have your x-ray button. And this is where you're going to turn the system on and off. The x-ray, excuse me, this is where you're going to actually press to shoot the x-ray. On the bottom, you have a place that you can put it on a tripod if you would like to do that. Over on the left-hand side, you have the power um, recharging capability. You have the ability to, to change the seconds with the roller mouse and so on. So when you're ready to take an x-ray, you have the dental sensor here. You actually place the sensor in, in, a, in a plastic bag that we will be providing for you. And that once you're ready to do that, you take that, you put it in the animal's mouth, and you aim it towards the, the animal, and you press trigger. When you hear the beep, it has taken the x-ray. Included in your package is a 2-inch uh, dental sensor that will attach directly to the USB port on the side of the right-hand side of the uh, Surface Pro. Um. All you have to do is go into the login screen and there is no password for the system. Today we are going to discuss how to take images using the Voyance software for dental. First thing that you do is you click on the Voyance icon. It's the blue triangle on the, on the left hand side. <clears throat> Next the screen will appear and what this will be is the user login. Under the engineering feature there is, a, uh, there is no password so you just click on login. We have three different tabs across the top, work list, add, and complete. The work list is x-rays that have been uh, assigned or ready to be taken. Add is where we add new patients. And completed, this is where all the completed studies are for that we have taken so far this year. If we want to take an emergency x-ray, to immediately go and take an x-ray of a patient, you just click on emergency. You come over here and click on dental. You select the areas that you want to take x-rays. And now you're ready to go. All you have to do is go back as we showed you and demonstrated in the beginning of this video on how to shoot an x-ray. Once you're done, you, can, you take the x-ray and the image will appear. If you want to add a new patient, you just click on add. Put the new patient in there, patient name, and the patient name is, since this is vet software, we're going to call this, um, you know, um, the patient's name, we're going to call it Fluffy Hutch. You also have the capability and put in the age of the dog, so, or the pup, and then you can put in what kind of animal it is. 
the sex of the animal. And if you, you want to definitely put the owner in here. And then once again, you click on the dental area, click on where you want to locate, and click on start. And now, as you can see down here, it says waiting to process the x-ray. When you're all done, the image will appear, and you will be able to save this and modify this. We'll click on done. And we actually save it. If we want to look at the completed study, let's just go in here and take a look at a completed study. Now, we've got several images out here, and but these are just test images, so don't get concerned with it. But we're going to double click on it. And we have the capability of using the tool sets here on the, on the right hand side. Say for example, we want to put a left marker on here. We want to put a label in here. You can add a label. You want to crop this image. You can click on the cropping indicator and actually crop this, crop this image by grabbing the dots and just double click on the inside. You can rotate the image. You can invert the image. And finally, you can take all your markings and everything off by clicking on the pencil down at the bottom. When you're done, just click Archive to the study. Once again, it saves it to the system. When you're done, you just click on Exit, and it takes you out of the, out of the screen, back to where you were. If you have any questions or concerns or need any help, we can actually log into your system at any time. Uh, please call our 1-800 number at 1-800-949-8015 and we'll log into your system and help you with any issues or train you on any of the solutions. Thank you.